in a place not far from here, amongst the moths and flies, lives a girl, a special girl, a girl who cannot die. Cobwebs drip from the ceiling, candles fill the room. She makes a nest to keep her safe in the dirt and the gloom. A ritual is her comfort. She has forgotten what it means. Butterflies and insects she hoards, collected from her dreams. Dark eyes are watching. They flicker in the walls. She knows there is danger out there. She heeds her creature's calls. Once she searched for the way, but now she does forget. A wraith trapped between worlds, this world and the next. So here she dwells all alone, in her shrine of wax and stone, and dirt and bone. The flutter of life is hers to bestow upon creatures untold, but not her own soul. She scours the stone in the old walled gardens amongst the trees so frail. Some say they have seen the scavenging girl with black lips, black eyes, and broken nails. dreams are a comfort, a fog of bliss for her alone. But when she wakes, she wakes alone in her shrine of wax and stone and dirt and bone. She collects her dreams to make new friends so she need not be alone. The creatures like from time to time to bring her fresh bones. Some friends lay unfinished. She must take her time. Companions, she says. They will all soon be, and soon they will all be mine. The birth of a new life is a joyous time for the girl. I think I will call him George. Her eyes could light up the world. How would you say so? Spake the creature in its favoured imp speak. It was no The flowers tell me the way. But the paths have all become lost. 
Sometimes the dead come to torment her. Beings from beneath all things tease and torture. They are here, the creatures would say, and then flee to pray in fear. <laughs> So she escapes into her world of dreams, where those foul beasts dare not follow. But her dreams offer only temporary solace from her feelings of sorrow. coin for the boatman she lost on her way unable to cross unable to pay she prays to the dead at the wishing tree bed hoping to follow in their beloved footsteps hoping one day that she might find her way home and escape this fate, this fate worse than death. Please take me with you, please take me home, she would pray to the dead bound in the roots, the roots beneath the stones. <laughs> She is home. 